Ethanol, the clean burning fuel made from corn and other biomass sources, which has been touted for years as a renewable resource that could replace oil, is finding new momentum as gasoline prices continue to rise. In fact, though still rare, the number of service stations offering ethanol has jumped a whopping 60 percent since the beginning of the year. And there are over 4 million vehicles on the road today with engines that can run on ethanol as well as gasoline. A flexible fuel vehicle is a vehicle that can run on pure gasoline. It can run on 10 percent ethanol and 90 percent gas, all the way up to 85 percent ethanol and 15 percent gasoline. This is very important because with the E85 flex fuel vehicles that we have today in the marketplace, if we can get them all running on E85, we can significantly reduce our dependence on foreign oil. Today, a gallon of E85 is 20 to 30 cents less than regular gasoline, and in ease of use at the pump and performance on the street, there is little difference. Rick Hiddle recently installed two E85 pumps at this service station in Tucson, Arizona. We've had a great response to E85 because people really like the fact that it displaces crude oil. You know, 85% is a direct displacement of a renewable fuel. Uh, it's a, such high oxygen content. It burns so thoroughly that it's a, it's a very low emission product. And, and those are, are very important to people. General Motors, which produces over a million trucks a year with standard flexible fuel engines, says its research shows as much as 30 percent of our gasoline consumption could be replaced by ethanol if it were to become available across the country. I'm Drew Maxwell.